Hello, people! It's Poet, and we are back in the dinosaur world. Now, today, before you get confused as to why this is a short episode, I am about to go record a special project with the Time Shot group. So, I have to make this a very short episode today, but that doesn't mean that it won't be full of excitement as usual. Now, we have a few missing dinosaurs in this park. We have always had missing dinosaurs over time. First of all, the fortune teller dino. What was, what was her name? Esmeralda. That's right, Esmeralda. She went missing, and we replaced her with this guy here, who I don't think has a name. You don't have a name, do you? Don't turn your back to me. Anyway, he doesn't have a name, even though he doesn't want to admit it to us. Um, so Esmeralda went missing, and we were pretty sure that she ran off with another dinosaur, but I've always wondered, like, what happened to Esmeralda? What if we could find Esmeralda in this world somewhere? The other one that went missing, well, Mary. Mary went missing. A lot of people noticed that, but Mary went missing. If we go into the enclosure here of the Triceratops, Mary isn't isn't there. Larry's here. Harry's here. You are a noisy guy. The last time we saw Mary, she was actually down here in this enclosure. But the raptors weren't eating her or anything like that. So I don't know what happened to her. I love that blue one. That blue one I think is my favorite. The green and blue one. Very cool. Anyway, that's kind of off to the side. I've always wondered what happened to Mary. Where did she go? You know, uh, did she run off this way? If we walk this way? Walk this way! Can we find her? What is that in the distance? That's a raptor back there! What's a raptor doing out of its enclosure? I thought it was a dodo for a second. I just see this dodo and then this raptor. Hey, you! Do I have my book? Yes, I do. Let's see who you are. You are mine! Owner po Piot Neto. Yeah! Don't you run away from... Bone. I need a bone. I don't have a bone. Well, you're just going to be out here now, I guess. Um, but it would be neat to see Mary out here somewhere. We've got a few Triceratops out here that I planted. A few Dodos. Brachiosaur way out there in the distance. Another Triceratops. And I think there's even a Stegosaur out there somewhere. I don't know. And the last one, and the most recent one, I think, that's gone missing, is the Gallimimus. The red Gallimimus that we didn't get to name. That's the problem. We didn't even get to name it, and it disappeared on us. Now, people have said that, you know, in that last episode when I moved our Gallimimus all the way to the racetrack that it wasn't there. But, you guys, I, I had so many awesome comments about the new intro. The new intro that we made. Um, it was not too difficult to make that intro. I had a lot of fun making it. Um, I used shader packs, I flew around, I got to see a lot of the, the world in a way that I don't get to usually see it from way up above and stuff like that. Um, but in my intro, for a split second, I come at it from this angle. Hold on. I come at it from, like, over the trees here. And when I fly down, I can clearly see the red Gallimimus. He is in the intro. And he's right over here. Now, I also worked on this off-camera. This whole enclosure. Now look at this. This has been a long, long, long time coming. This I have to take down that tree. Uh, but this has been a long time coming. I just went around here. I used as much spruce as I could. I used all the oak that I could. 
and I got this new enclosure all around here. I am going to starve to death. I need to go back and get some food! Which one of you is Sweet Tooth? They all look the same now. They're all the same size. Sweet Tooth, is that you? Is that you? It's whichever one's the oldest one. Uh, 24 days, that's pretty old. Maybe you're Sweet Tooth, I don't know. I need to get name tags. Need to get name tags. Uh, food. There we go. A lot of people also telling me in the comments, just want to address it right now, uh, that I do have potato farm up top, and I haven't forgotten the potato farm up top. Uh, but I'm not really into potatoes right now. You know how you get sick of some foods when you eat it too much? That's part of it. But... It's also the fact that I have to cook potatoes, whereas a bread, I can just go like this, and boom, I got bread. So I don't need to cook anything, everything is good, tastes good, nice sandwich. There we go. See? Easy. So I don't need potatoes to cook. Did I get everything out of here? I think that I did. Yeah, okay. So, I'm just like, I'm constantly watching the time. Because like I said, I have to go, like, really, really soon. But I want to push this episode as as far as I can without making people annoyed that I'm late. What's up, Mr. Park Supervisor Guy? Mr. Diamond Booties? Blingy Booties? You have something to tell me? No? All right. He's just, like, overlooking the park. That's his job. To oversee and and run the park when I'm out of town. Now, the Gallimimus. Back to the Gallimimus. Oops, I fell into a pit. Uh, the Gallimimus was over here in the intro. In the intro, it was clearly just standing right around here. It could have gone this way. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I'm floating away. Come on, please. There we go. Where could it have gone? It could have gone in this direction. Up here. Ran over this way. That's one of the, the park's mysteries. Is that I will forever be looking for these dinosaurs. You know? And I almost feel like what I should do is make some kind of a search party. I should put together a search. Maybe what I'll do, and this will be part of me releasing a map download for this park. Um, a lot of people also asking, you know, when am I going to update the world download? I've got a world download, but it's from like May, I think. May of 2014. And we're now sitting in, as of this recording, November of 2014 so it's been a while it's definitely been a while uh, that's why I'm finishing things like this enclosure here which has been a long time coming I've always wanted to finish this one it's still not completely finished I need to put glass and I'd like to replace all the stone down there with grass and all the torches I want to replace with the glowstone pieces like I got there because these brachiosaurs can't break glowstone pieces and let's see. Yeah, so what I want to do is make an update. Oh yeah, I wanted I want to finish this first. After I finish this and I might do this today after my big group recording with the time shop folks, I might go and come back on this this world here and finish this. Uh, I'm probably going to make it a little bit higher, a little bit taller. Maybe not. Maybe. Maybe not. And I'm going to put the top on. Now, I think the grass should be done. It was spread up there the last time I was up there. I don't have any way to get up there, do I? Let's see if we can find a way. I need some dirt. I need some dirt. So I'll go to the dirt chest. Uh, grab a stack. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh, uh oh. Sky does Minecraft fan. What are you doing banging on their door? Whoa. There we go. You guys all right? Scary times. I think what I needed to do... I tried to make this look a little bit better. But I think I still need to go like that. And that way, if you go like this, zombies can't get in. They'll they'll hit the door and they'll make a lot of noise. But they won't be able to break it and get in. Um, unfortunately, a guy like that... Like that... Who has a helmet on... Well... Oh, and this guy right here. That was weird. I, I just got like some weird... My mouse stopped working for a second there. And then when it came back, my screen just like... Bang, downwards. But you get a guy like this with a, a hat on. And he won't die in the sun. So my little friends there will come out of their house thinking it's safe in the sun. And he will get them. So I can't have that. Oh! There we go. So I see what needs to be lit up there. There we go. There we go. Light it up. Light it up. And this too. Bam. There we go. Check the time. I got two minutes. Ish. Oh no! See what he's doing? You see? I fixed it so that... He's going to jump all day long, but he's not going to be able to to break that door. That should be fine. Don't get too close, though, villager guy, because he will hit you through the door. So I just have to, like, light this place up like crazy and basically zombie-proof it. That'll be a very difficult task, but I'll try to do that. So, did I ever finish that thought? That's what I'll do. Let's finish that thought and tell you guys, you know, once I come on here, I'll finish this giant tower thing. And once I'm done that, I'm going to release the world download. And what I want you guys to do in the new world download, this is coming up. Not today. Probably not tomorrow. But whenever I come up with the world download, um, and you'll see the November link in the description uh i will ask you guys to go and help me look for the missing dinosaurs for esmeralda for mary for the unnamed red gallimimus and actually someone could probably also tell me where those mosasaurs went the ones that were in the water that are now just disappeared swam off to who knows where but I think that would be a kind of a, a neat little thing for people to do, is help me look for the missing dinosaurs. So I think that's kind of the project that we're going to set up. Um, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this very short video, where we just kind of chatted about the park and stuff and what's going to go on. You know who I want to see before we leave the park? Before we leave is this Dinonychus. Now, I've also heard people pronounce it Dinonychus, or Dinonychus, or Dinonychus, but what? Ah! Oh, that guy scared me. Uh, I always pronounce it Dinonychus just because I can be different. I'm looking at this little guy. He's growing up. He's got his feathers now, which is really cool. He's starting to look pretty good. I actually like his eyes, the way that his eyes look if we get in good zoom. I like the way that his eyes look compared to this guy's. Just kind of a preference thing, I think. Screenshot. So, with that little screenshot there, I think we'll end it. Thank you guys for watching! Share this video on Twitter and Facebook. Subscribe if you haven't already and do all those other awesome things that people do and we'll see you next time in the dinosaur world. Bye-bye!